I'm Erin Holly, your neighborhood news reporter here at the Texas State Aquarium Wildlife Rescue Center. A 100 pound loggerhead sea turtle is recovering right here from multiple broken bones in her front left flipper and under her shell. It's going to be a long road to recovery for this loggerhead turtle. We were able to recover the loggerhead, bring it into the aquarium's wildlife rescue program. Uh, got a full workup from our veterinarians uh, and is, is starting to recover. With broken humerus bones in her front left flipper and fractures in her shell, the loggerhead was rescued near Cole Park Pier Tuesday evening. What we typically see is as these larger turtles come in and depending on what their injuries are, uh, you know, turtles just by the nature are slower and so is the healing process. So uh, we'll see loggerheads this size stay for, you know, certainly three or four months, maybe even into early fall. Jesse Gilbert, the president and CEO of Texas State Aquarium, says seeing loggerheads wash up ashore isn't uncommon. What's challenging about loggerheads are they're big. So this animal is about 100 pounds. We've seen them up to about 125, 130 pounds, but they're also very aggressive towards each other. So when we get loggerheads in, we have to separate them, which just inherently takes more space. Gilbert says several loggerhead turtles washed up ashore in 2021, but he says he doesn't see another event like that happening again. So hopefully this is just a one off and, and you know, it's an animal that just got in trouble, found its way into Corpus Christi Bay and is now here. But this loggerhead turtle wasn't the only one to wash up ashore in the coastal bend this week. This loggerhead was rescued by the Ark in Port Aransas on Wednesday, having the Texas State Aquarium be on the lookout for more potentially injured turtles. For now, this loggerhead getting state of the art medical care. Uh, and again, our prognosis is, is uh, good. We think this animal will recover slowly, but will recover. Texas State Aquarium veterinarians expect her to be in recovery here for at least a few months. I'm your neighborhood news reporter on North Beach, Aaron Holly, Chris Six News.